Hello, princesses, and welcome back to Not Fit for Print Beauty with me, Rebecca. We have a fun one today. There is a giant Wheel of Fortune wheel behind me. Your eyes are not deceiving you. We're going to talk today about a bunch of cool new products from Laura Geller Beauty. I am thrilled to have you here. Please don't forget that you can also join me over on TikTok Instagram and on threads. Okay, let's get started. Laura Geller is a brand that makes the most beautiful, easy to use, very sophisticated makeup for every age, every generation, ageless, completely ageless. They have done some really fun things. So a few days ago, I went to a Laura Geller event held at Sony Pictures Studios here in the Los Angeles area. And this was for the release of the Wheel of Fortune collection. Don't worry, I'll show it to you. And this is a beautiful collection that we are going to talk about today. Um, it contains eyeshadow, face palette, all sorts of stuff. Using spokesperson Vanna White. Vanna White is gorgeous at any age. That woman does not age. She does not age. And the event was really fun. The event had all of the products that I'm going to show you today, and you could get it applied by makeup artists on the scene, which of course I did. And so I have those beautiful products to share with you now. Everything we talk about here will be linked below, along with information about our $4.99 a month private membership here on YouTube. We have weekly gossipy lives, and we would love to see you there. Okay, let's dive in. The other thing I want to talk about is the Laura Geller Serum Blush Cheek Tint. Uh, we're going to talk about that and we're going to try them all on. Let's just dive right in. First of all, we have this new release of the Laura Geller Serum Blush Cheek Tint tint. There are seven shades, $28 each, which is totally doable. We're going to use it in the demo, but I'm going to show you it now. Basically, it is what you might remember from so many of these kind of serum blushes, whether it be Surratt, Charlotte Tilbury, Tarte. They wind up and there's a sponge that you press the product out and it comes out. You can apply this onto a Another brush, you can apply it directly to the face. You can put it onto your hand first, whatever you want. It's got all sorts of great skincare ingredients. There's seven shades, which you'll see in a moment. $28 each, totally affordable and really nice. The other thing that's really cool is that each of the cheek shades, and this is to me super innovative, comes with a replacement little sponge for the top. So if you ever feel that you are working through it, you want a different sponge, you could replace it. I think that's actually really cool and it comes with each of these shades. I want to show you the seven shades. Take a look here. Again, these are $28 each and uh, here they are on my arm in studio lighting and I want to read the names of the shades to you and then we'll take them outside. From left to right we have Beautiful Blossom which we'll use in the demo, Graceful Guava, Blushing Berry, True Tawny, Refreshing Rose, Practical Pink, and Puppy Peach. There they are on my arm in studio lighting. I have a box here that they all came in. They are so beautiful. I have all seven of them and I have been using them like crazy because they're like this watercolor tint. They're so gentle and transparent. You kind of cannot overuse them. And yet they, the look really lasts and they're really plumping because of the skincare ingredients. They're definitely a winner. And if you are interested in that kind of a product, this is one you'll like. Um, this is actually tied with Surratt for me really, because they go on so gently. You could just keep going and going. But let's look at all seven shades outside in the warm California sunshine. Take a look at those. Aren't they gorgeous? And you can put them on your finger and tap them onto your cheek on a brush or just directly to the face. Um, and they don't pick up any makeup underneath. They didn't displace my foundation. You'll see in the demo. It's beautiful. They're really, really a nice product. Laura Geller is doing so much. There's more coming out, I happen to know, for holiday 2023. But right now, the biggest new release, other than those beautiful blushes, they're really getting innovative over there, is this collaboration with Vanna White and Wheel of Fortune. Uh, that was the event I went to the other day. But you got to see this. They also issued some PR. Some, some places get so creative with PR. We're going to spin this together. It's an actual Wheel of Fortune. Well, not actual, but it's a replica Wheel of Fortune wheel. Look at that. 
So I'm going to spin. If I get bankrupt, I won't edit it, I promise. Okay, ready? <laughs> Let's see. What did I get? What did I get? What did I get? Oh, it's moving. It's moving. Oh, it looked like I got $700. Okay. And then when you lift it up, inside are the products. Is that cool or is that cool? My kids are going to want that. The products are... A Laura Geller Wheel of Fortune eyeshadow palette. Now you can get this whole, everything I'm talking about here, you can get like six pieces for 140, which isn't bad if you're gifting it. You don't get the wheel. That was a PR fun thing, but um, you will get all six pieces for 140. We're going to talk about all of them. You can get the winning palettes collection, which is three pieces for 79. Um, but let me show you what that would be. So that would be this, uh, eyeshadow palette here, 45 if you buy it alone. Isn't that cute? We're going to see it swatched in a minute. Really usable shades, and I'm going to put them on in the demo. There is the face palette, which is just a bunch of blush, and they're beautiful for $49. Yep, looks like a wheel. That's $49 if bought alone, or you can get it in the three-piece and six-piece set. And then, of course, this brush, which we'll use. is a really Laura Geller brushes are really nice. Um, this is the two-sided brush, but we're going to use some more that are in my collection, and I'll list them below. Part of that six-piece set, or you can buy it individually, is a really nice um, eyeliner for $22, or you can buy it separately. The primer, have you ever tried the Laura Geller primer? It's really good, and this is a reissue of that for $36 alone, or part of the larger collection. And the lipstick, boy is this red. It is so beautiful red, and it is $21 on its own, or part of the six piece collection. I'm actually wearing that now as a stain, and it's beautiful because it's cool toned. So as a stain, it's kind of a hot pink, but if you put it on, you'll see in the swatches, it's super dark red. It's almost like two lipsticks in one, and it's really comfortable, not drying, a really kind of nice satin finish. Let's take a look at this here. I wanna show you what I got. First in studio lighting, here it is on my arm. We have the eyeshadow palette up top, and the blush palette down beneath it with the eyeshadow. Of course, you can see what the eyeshadow is, and that beautiful red lipstick in its full form. You'll see on my lips here right now, I am wearing it as a stain and it's like almost like a hot pink, but you see it there on my arm and it's kind of full effect, it's bright red. Here it is on me in pink. Now let's take this outside into the warm California sunshine. And there we go with the eyeshadow palette on top, the blush palette, eyeliner, and lipstick on the bottom. So nice. We are going to now go to the demo. I want to play around with these. I can't do this amount of beautiful makeup justice, but I am certainly going to try. And I am remiss if I do not thank Laura Geller for sending these to me, inviting me to the event, which was so much fun and so kind of just like chill and relaxing with amazing food and drink. So, so nice. And, you know, with Vanna White. Like, you can't beat that, right? Hey, do me a favor and check. Are you subscribed to this channel? I am trying to reach 20,000 mighty quick. We passed 18,000 a little bit ago, but I have my eyes on the prize with 20, and I need your help to get there. So if you haven't, could you take a moment to click subscribe? All right, I'm never going to do justice to all the beautiful makeup in front of me right now, but I'm going to try. And I want to work with all of it. I think I'm going to do... Some of the Serum Blush Cheek Tint underneath this uh, Wheel of Fortune face palette. So let's start with the beautiful Blossom shade. We're gonna put that on both cheeks. I'm gonna do a real look here, not a kind of mismatched look. It's just such a pretty pink, but it's so sheer that I really think, and it doesn't lift any product, which I really love. It's so sheer that I really think it'll look nice with a powder blush over it. Now, I'm just kind of patting it in. It doesn't pull up any product. It's really pretty. And it just got has that little bit kind of of a glow to it. And I'm not going to really over apply. I mean, it would be nice for me to over apply, I suppose, a bit more uh, so you can see the shade. But I want to put a powder blush over it because I'm just kind of having fun with these products. But look how pretty that is just for every day and that's the bright kind of you know barbie-ish kind of pink for lack of a better term and it's still really wearable and it feels really nice and cool and skincare-y on the face you know when you put on really nice skincare and you're kind of like ah 
that's the feeling. Okay, now I'm gonna take this Wheel of Fortune. Um, we're gonna look at the blush set here. And we're gonna take the brush here. This is the brush that is part of the set. And I'm gonna go in to this shade right here in the middle and just kind of tap that over. Now you're gonna say, Rebecca, that's peach. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I'm just trying to get kind of a layered look. We have pink and peach. And that will also help the longevity of the blush. I think that looks really quite pretty. I'm very, very happy with that. Okay, um, and that, that was just using the middle shade, but of course you saw them all swatched. Putting that in a little bit more. Okay, super, super pretty. That is the face palette not doing it justice by any means. I want to take this red lipstick. Oh my goodness, it's my nemesis. It's so red. You know I tend to wear these as a little bit of a stain. So I am going to kind of blot this on and rub it in. Only because I'm on camera and I get a little bit of performance anxiety with application of lipstick. And whenever I say that, I get a lot of people in comments telling me how not to be nervous when putting on red lipstick. And I have to tell them it, it's a little bit of an act for the camera, but you know, it is kind of true. It's a lot if someone's watching you put on a deep red shade. So I tend to avoid it. And I like this though, you guys, because this is a really cool based red and look how it blended so beautifully and how it's easy to wear as a stain. Let me dot some on. And it almost, because it's cool toned, is coming off as like a deep pink. That's really pretty. Super comfy too. But I just like to wear these really dark shades as a stain. And I think that's working really, really well. But look, I mean, if you want to do, you saw in the swatches, if you wanted to really go to town, if you really like a dark, dark red, I know that our channel member and subscriber here, Quincy, loves a dark red. She would love that. Comment below if you're a dark red lover too, but as a stain, it's almost a hot pink. Okay, let's dive into, we got a few cool things here. So we've got this eyeliner, which I wanna try out, and you saw that. I'm gonna put a little bit of this, I think, in the waterline. Now I got to try this all out at the event uh, that they did at Sony Studios here in Los Angeles, and I do admit, that I'm lucky to live in LA to get to go to that. Very, very pretty. I mean, I got to try all these out and I remember being super impressed by the eyeliner. And funnily enough, the makeup artist on site who was doing all the looks the day that day was herself extraordinarily impressed. It's a nice liner. Okay, let's take a look at this beautiful palette here. Um, and we are going to, should I make the buy a val joke or should I not? I am using some Laura Geller brushes here in this video because she has some beautiful synthetic brushes in her lineup. And that's super fun. Look at that. Oh my gosh, so fun. So fun, okay, let's see. I have some sparkles, but I think I wanna go in with this shade right here. And yes, I'm taking the same brush. There is no need to create brush laundry. And I'm just kind of going over and out there. Okay, and under, this brush is really nice. This is not part of the collection. This is in my collection. It is a Laura Geller brush. And it's just really nice because it will kind of work at like a, almost like a little eyeshadow fan brush, but it has this really narrow tip. So it's really easy to work with and really pretty, I think. Okay, I want a kind of a crease shade. Hmm, okay, so I'm gonna go in here. Yes, this will get a little bit of the deeper shade in it from what I was just working with, but I'm okay with that. And then we'll do something really fun. Okay, so, so far so good. I'm liking it a lot, I hope you are too. And I wanna go in with this, this shade right here and just put it all the way across the lid. I'm just kind of smoothing it across the lid. It's shimmer without being too shimmery and certainly no fallout. Let's do a little more there. Isn't that pretty? I love it. Okay, I want a little bit more oomph, so I'm gonna go in with this shade here, and I'm gonna go into the corner and onto the lid with the shade right here. What do you think? 
Isn't that pretty? I made sure that I listed all of this below. I mean, the primer is out of this world. There's so many good things on Laura Geller's website. So you gotta check it out. Super pretty, look at that, wow. Absolutely loving it. And I know that there's more um, coming for the holidays from Laura Geller, the brand and the makeup artist. She just doesn't stop with this creative, fun makeup. And it's easy to apply and really reliable. And there's even more coming. If you haven't checked out the brand, please use those links below to just go visit the website and see what you think. Uh, I'm such a big fan. I'm wearing today of my base, the powder makeup foundation, which is really nice. Lots of good things from this brand and a seriously easy to wear red, this Wheel of Fortune color. That dotted on is like a hot pink, almost like two colors in one. So that's incredibly, incredibly cool. Uh, tell me what your thoughts are. So many Laura Geller fans out there in my viewership. So many of you have told me that you really rely on her powders and I think you would enjoy this too so easy to wear. I mean, look how quick that look was. So let me know what you think. Get yourself some of these serum blushes. So pretty. Uh, and tell me your thoughts because that's what makes us a community. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe. You know it. More stuff coming up as we head really fast into the holidays. My goodness. Coming up soon, we're even going to have our community-wide best of beauty for the year. I do it every year, so start getting ready for that as well. Exciting stuff, and I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Bye-bye.